Dear students, I welcome you in the course of Leadership, Emotional Intelligence and Decision Making. This is module number 254 and the topic under discussion is the creative thinking process. Remember being a leader, we need to have creativity. Or us creativity say hum right decision making wo kar sakte hain jisme ke tamam tar stakeholder ke jo concerns hain wo acche tarike se entertain wo ho sake ab is creative thinking process mein there are different aspects which are discussed the first aspect is preparation when we talk about the preparation remember that is the hard work you have to collect and sort the relevant information analyze the problem as thoroughly as you can and explore possible solutions. So, that would be the starting point. Jahan se hamara depth mind jo hai, wo activate ho pata hai. Uske baad is the incubation. The incubation would mean that this is the depth mind phase. Jahan se depth mind apni working ko start karega. Jabke, jaisa ke preparation was the trigger and the incubation is the start of the depth mind processes. Mental work analyzing and synthesizing and valuing continues on the problem if your subconscious mind, the parts of the problem separate and new combinations occur, these may involve other ingredients stored away in your memory. So, this is important hoga because depth mind jo hai, wo analysis, synthesis, valuing in tamam cheezon ko focus mein wo rakhta hai. Iske baad, the next step would be that there is insight. Or jab hum insight ki baat karte hai, to that is the eureka moment. By the word Eureka, we mean to say that a new idea emerges into your conscious mind either gradually or suddenly, like a fish flashing out of the water. These moments often occur when you are not thinking about the problem but are in a relaxed frame of mind. So, si cheezein, they come up as waves. Si cheezein, mein ek dam se hoti hain. Si cheezein, mein ek dam se hoti hain. So, that is basically the insight we are having, creative thinking ke andar, when we talk about depth mind processes. And last but not the least aspect is the validation. This is where your valuing faculty comes into play. A new idea, insight, intuition, hunch or solution needs to be thoroughly tested. This is especially so if it is to perform the basis for actions of any kind. So, validation ke andar, obviously, our mind cheezon ko evaluate kar raha hoga. Hum bohat se cheezon ka sahara wo le rahe honge, jisme ke humare ideas, humare insights, humare intuition, humare gut feeling, ye sab ki sab cheezen kaar firma hongi. Aur in sab cheezon ke mil jane se hi, humare intuition and rationality ke combine hone se hi, humare creative thinking process wo complete hoti hai, aur humara active mind, aur humara depth mind, wo hume aise ideas de pata hai, which are otherwise not apparently in our conscious processes. अपने आप को माइंडफुल रखना वो बहुत जरूरी है एंड नो डाउट इस सारे थिंकिंग प्रोसेस के अंदर डेप्थ माइंड के हवाले से भी अपनी माइंडफुल एक्सरसाइजेस को वी आल्सो हैव टू परफॉर्म डियर स्टूडेंट्स अगर हम इस सारी बात को कंक्लूड करें तो याद रखें कि डीप थिंकिंग तदब्बर एंड तफक्कुर दीस आर रिक्वायर्ड फिनोमिनास दीस आर द रिक्वायरमेंट्स ऑफ द टाइम एंड दीस आर रिक्वायरमेंट्स ऑफ एवरी सिचुएशन जहां पर भी हम ऑपरेट वो कर रहे होंगे देयरफॉर अपनी क्रिएटिविटी को सपोर्ट करें अपने डेप्थ माइंड प्रोसेसेस के साथ ताकि ऐसे नतीजे हासिल हों विच आर रिक्वायर्ड बाय द ऑर्गेनाइजेशन थैंक यू